generally the, the entire population uh, is, is susceptible to this uh, to, to monkeypox. That assessment Friday from Canada's top public health officials as doctors try to figure out what's behind outbreaks of monkeypox worldwide. We need to, to, to learn more about it. You know, has it evolved? Has it changed to something different in terms of uh, the mode of transmission and so on? There's probably been some hidden chains of transmission that could have occurred for quite a, a number of weeks, uh, given the sort of global uh, situation that we're seeing right now. At least a dozen countries, including ours, have reported confirmed and suspected infections. The World Health Organization says there are about 80 confirmed cases so far, with another 50 pending investigation. The WHO says it's working with the affected countries and others to expand disease surveillance to find and support people who may be affected. The WHO is calling the global spread atypical, as most of the recent cases had no relevant travel history to places where monkeypox is endemic. You have to remember that monkeypox outbreaks are not unprecedented. What's different is that this is transmitting between person to person without travel. Despite its unusual arrival, the risk to the wider public is said to be low because the virus, thought to be milder than smallpox, is not very contagious in typical social settings, unlike COVID-19. There's a danger of viewing every further infectious disease outbreak through the lens of COVID-19. And you have to draw distinctions between a virus like SARS-CoV-2 and a virus like monkeypox, which spread in a totally different way. The current outbreak here in Canada is small, with about two dozen possible cases under investigation. So why is nearly everyone vulnerable? Well, experts point to the smallpox vaccine, which the CDC says past evidence shows is at least 85% effective in preventing monkeypox. But routine vaccination here in Canada ended decades ago. Now, our country does keep a stockpile of smallpox vaccines. However, it will not say just how many doses are available. Karen Siolin, City News.